It took 58 years for Bill Gonzalez to make it back. On Tuesday, the Navy veteran of the Korean War stepped onto the USS Iowa and back into his memories of two years aboard the battleship. The Iowa, now retired and recently docked in San Pedro, opens to the public Saturday, July 7th as a permanent maritime museum. The ship was open Tuesday only to veterans who had served on it and their friends and families. The 78-year-old Gonzalez, who now lives in Fontana, was joined by the press enterprise as he climbed through the ladders and ducked through the doorways once again. We used to stand watch out here in Korea. And uh, the, everything you put on, it was 70, 80 below, no matter how. So we would try to hide in a paint locker up there, and get away from the wind, you know, you're going into the wind all the time. Uh -huh. And if you freeze your, your butt out. You put a cigarette in your mouth right here, and with the liquid, it would freeze right there, your cigarette would freeze. So we didn't smoke up here. The turret number two was the metal station. Right there, turret number two. Down, down in the powder room, seven decks below. So we buy the selling stuff in here. <laughs> Tell me again what we're looking at. Well, this is an officer's quarters here. It's got to be below deck, though. So. Yeah. These officer's quarters here. And we used to we used to make their beds too. But when I worked my up to he, he, he executive officer, I just worked for him, nobody else. Reporter Mark Muckenfoos, I'm Chris Erkley with the Press Enterprise and PE.com.